In this video, we will see how to import items from Microsoft Excel. We will show you how CodeBeamer can easily handle large data and import over 500 requirements into the CodeBeamer. Since CodeBeamer brings a really tight integration into Microsoft Office, any further analysis can be conducted using Microsoft Excel. So therefore, I will go to my CodeBeamer. As you can see here, in our requirements management, we don't have any requirements in here. But I will go to my desktop and open up a file where we do have some requirements in here. And the CodeBeamer brings some really elaborate import features, such as the first row can be read as properties of the individual requirements. And another thing is using the intent functionality in Microsoft Excel, um, hierarchies can be built, meaning right now importing test cases from CVS files would be the father requirement of the importing and exporting test cases. If I do like this, currently the importing test cases and the importing executing test cases requirement would be the same hierarchies. But if I use the intent functionality, this would be the father requirement and this would be the child requirement. Let's just save this and let's go to the CodeBeamer, go under more, then go our import. Then I will mark Microsoft Excel. You can see it on here. The rules of import are summed up down here. I will choose the file, the ones are, the one I currently opened. Then I will click on next. And right now the CodeBeamer has a pretty elaborate import wizard since the first row will be recognized and mapped as you can see here. Also, I can set up my import row. Currently, I want to start the import the data at row two. Therefore, I'm going to click on next. I don't want to do any mapping at the moment. And this is the preview of our import. And I like this preview. Therefore, I want to click on finish. And as you can see, it takes a few seconds to import over 500 requirements. Here we are just importing those requirements. And as you can see here on the left side, importing test cases, when I open this one up, is the father requirement of importing and exporting test cases. Thanks for watching.